Hello, hi, welcome. My name is Pujit. I'm here to present Social Bus Data Analysis Project. Talking about today's agenda, at first, I'm going to discuss about the project recap. I'm going to discuss about the problem, as well as I'm going to introduce the analytics team. At last, I'm going to share how I did the project and the process and steps followed by insights, and I'm going to end up with summary. All right, let's move into the project recap. At first, what is Social Buzz? Social Buzz is a platform similar to Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, where it produces a lot of content from the users. Social Buzz needs to adapt quickly to its global scale. So it has assigned a project to Essential of as focusing mainly three viewers in focusing on this task. First, the task is an audit of Social Buzz big data practice, recommendations for a successful IPO, and access to find social bus to find most popular categories of the content. Now I'm gonna share the problem. As earlier I told, social bus is a platform where it produces a lot of content. According to the data statistical thing, the team has to be over 100,000 posts have been produced per day and 3,605,000 ,000 pieces of content has been produced per year, but they don't know how to capitalize and where to stop. So they had to find a team from Accenture analysis to find out the social bus to find most popular categories of the content. Now I'm gonna introduce the analytics team. The first member is Chief Technical Architect, who is Andrew Fleming, gonna share the insights of the project and guide the project as well as resources of the project. The second member of the analytics team is Marcus Ramton, who works as a data engineer and a senior principal at Accenture. At last, myself, as a data analyst, to find out the insights from the raw data and make decisions. Now, I want to share the process, how I did this project. At first, I have categorized it into five steps. The first phase is data understanding, where I did the review of the data sets provided by the company, and I need to understand what should be needed in the data. Followed by the next step, which is data cleaning. I clean the data set by removing null values and removing the outliers for the accurate data analysis. Now, the third stage is data modeling. After all, there were three data sets provided by the company. Now, I use the functions like XLOOKUP, VLOOKUP, and some if to calculate the scores. At last, once the data set is formed, I load it into the tabular to find out the data insights and draft the data visualization. And plus, the final phase is how to uncover the insights. After all the data live visualization is formed, I dive deeper into the data to uncover more useful insights for more questions the stakeholders might have. Now, I wanna share the insights which are drafted from Tableau. These are the top five categories. We can clearly see that Animals has high similarity score of 74,965. On the other hand, people show much more content produced in science, healthy heating, technology, and food. Now, I want to share about the percentage share of top five categories. I can clearly see that most of the audience has shown interest of animals producing content, which can be seen at a percentage of 21,364. On the other hand, such as food, healthy heating, science, and technology also produce a past average percentage of 19 to 20. Now, I want to show about this. Now, I... since there were total number of posts, I want to share about the sentiments across the posts. There were three categories of sentiment posts, such as positive, negative, and neutral. I can really clearly see most of the people on social bus has been posted a positive content, which can be seen at a value of 13,807. On the other hand, the neutral has post also recorded of 3,071. And now I want to find out the total number of posts across the month. This can be done by using line graph so that I can see from January to December, how much posts are recorded in each segment. For example, in January, the highest number of posts have been recorded in the month of January as a positive, which can be seen at a value of 1087. On the other hand, the negative and neutral posts are recorded with 678 and 261. Likewise, we can check the number of posts in other months using this line graph.
Now I want to share the overall insights of the project. After finding the data visualization, I found that there were 16 winning categories in which the highest number of reactions to the animal post, which can be seen at a value of 1897. And the monthly highest most posts were recorded in the month of January. Now I want to find out the end up with summary. After doing the analysis, many people love two types of content, mostly the animals and science. They enjoy learning about real life things about the factual information. Now the insight is food is the popular topic among the five categories. Healthy eating is the most favored one. This insight can be guiding in creating a campaign and collaborating with healthy eating brands to increase user engagement. At last, the next final step reactions that need to taken by Accenture, which needs to provide a recommendation to the social bus team is to in take to analysis into the latter scale production for the real time of understanding of the business. And undoubtedly, I can clearly say that this has provided a valuable insights and help more informed decisions. Thank you.